was so, so close. Welcome to another episode of my Minecraft Survival Let's Play. You know what? I'm gonna sleep for a bit. Today is gonna be a bit different. As you can probably see, you want to get back to that clutch moment back there. Very surprising, very suspenseful, and... Yeah, you never know what's going to do until you get to that, but... The rest of this is basically just going to be a very quick overview of how did I actually get there. As quick as possible. So, if you remember from the last bit of the series, I set up a pretty good base. And at this point, I'm going to be starting from getting Ender Pearls. You get the Eyes of Ender, found the Stronghold. Found the stronghold, fought the Ender Dragon. That was something. I don't know. Maybe you want to see a bit more. Probably not. It was just basically just me hiding in holes. It was not that exciting, at least from a viewer's perspective. Set up a flying machine to go across the void. Um, need the slime blocks for that and everything. Um, so across the void. Tried to find an end city. Probably should have recorded that moment. End city, kind of low pillar there. Anyway, I have the elytra. I have a beginnings of a shulker box anyway. Now I just need to survive my way back. Didn't have a lot on me. Didn't have any rockets. Which is a bit of an oversight, but didn't want to have too much valuable on me to lose anyway. I only have a limited amount of gunpowder at this point. So I got th to the end city, got the elytra, and the challenge, of course, is on my way back. Now, on my way back, I was trying to prevent Endermen from getting to me. And, I mean, it's a bit tricky because now they're spawning on the bridge. So, now I have to go around them. And I'm trying to build these little walls or things that are two blocks off the ground in order to stop them from going. Little do I know they can actually teleport past those. And that's how you end up in a situation where you are falling off... And then, of course, I die oh, anyway because had the Elytra Elytra actually can teleport to my surprise. Well, can teleport that far. Right, well, I guess I and really have to go get yeah. it now. My strategy here is just dig a hole as fast as possible and hopefully everything will land. Every item I lose lands there rather than in the void where I lose them. So I'm trying to get my first and so far only Elytra home. And now, of course, I have to run all the way back through the nether and the end in order to get to it. Anyway, I think that was some good lessons learned, and hopefully a 
fun little bit of excitement on an otherwise routine Minecraft type trip. And now that I do have an elytra, I will be trying to find that mangrove swamp, find some more elytras, and get on with the rest of this Let's Play world. So we'll see you in the next episode, I hope. Please like and subscribe if you want to see more of this. Leave a comment if there's something you want me to make. I will do my best to try to um, have that in one of my future videos. And yeah, look forward to more of this. Have a good day. Valuable of the valuables. I am back. So, so close.